Hey guys, it's Becky. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you're already a subscriber, thanks for coming back. Feels like forever since I've done a proper sit down chatty video with you guys. We're going to set up the week of the 1st to the 7th of April in my Take a Note Planner, which is my personal journal, which I have been keeping up with, so I'm really, really happy with that. I've got a new um, filming set up at the minute. I've got a new tripod lighting system, everything like that. So let me know if you know it's a difference in the um, quality, because I know some people were saying it wasn't focusing properly and things like that. So hopefully we've got that fixed. I'm going to be using this gorgeous kit called Backyard Book Lover, and it's from Graceful Muse Papery. I've got two kid discount codes down below for her. The first one is if you've never shopped with her before, you get a little bit extra. And the second one is if you have shopped with her before. So I'm going to be using this kit in this planner and also probably in my Paper Test Designs TN one. So we've got loads to work with here, loads of decorative pieces, loads of edges, loads of functionals. If you want to put any functionals, loads of washi strips and deco. And then I don't think I'll be using these. Like I tend to use these as and when, like in the day if I need to. And then I've also got this sheet of clear stickers as well. So I'm going to put those off to one side. And then I'm going to do my usual and surround myself with stickers. This is a bit of an odd filming setup for me because my lighting is literally right where my head is. So, what we're going to do, let's have a look. Let's cover up the Monday through Sunday. How have you all been? How has everyone been? Because it has been a while, hasn't it? Oh, I'm obsessed with my uh, new bag, my Teddy Blake bag. Like, I just want to go out and keep using it everywhere because it's just so bloody gorgeous. Um, so, I hope you enjoyed that video. I'm not very good at videos like that. Let me know down below as well if you've been following me on Instagram because I've been doing stories on Instagram and I go on there every single day and do like a little, sometimes it's more than once a day, quite often not it's more than once a day, but all the like behind the scenes stuff and all that, it's, I'm, over, I'm over on the gram guys, I'm over there, so pop over and say hello, but if you're already following me over there then let me know down below, let me know down below. Um, so we've got the days down, now, how do we want to do this? It's kind of just a place anything, anywhere you want kind of thing. I'm just looking and I don't have loads of actual decorative boxes. These are quite small. So I might use these clear ones because they're a little bit bigger. And there is definitely no rhyme or reason for how I put these down. Right, let's use some of these. So how have you guys been? What have you been up to? So Chris ended up getting his um, compensation for his knee and uh, we spent it all already. Like, we didn't have a choice. There were so many things that we were putting off getting that we really, really needed. Like a new Hoover, we needed a carpet cleaner. Like, and when I say we needed a carpet cleaner, we needed a carpet cleaner. We have got like uh, three kids and two dogs and it, it was just getting beyond a joke. We had to, we had to get one. Because especially because we live in military accommodation, um, it's like we will get fined if if we don't keep the uh, accommodation up to scratch, up to scratch as they say. Um, I got a new iMac which I was chuffed about because my um, oh I'll go on there won't it my MacBook was on its last legs, but then I've only gone and bloody broke my MacBook as well. Like, I was trying to delete it so I could give it to Willow, because Willow wanted it, but I ended up deleting, like, the main disc. So I've had to take that in to get that looked at and fixed, which we're going to have to pay for. I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. Right, let's get... I do like these corner pieces. I like doing these types of plan with me's because there's nothing specific 
and just plunk things down and just have a chat with you guys. Yes, yeah, so we had to get new hoovers, which was a bit of a drag, but you know, we did that. And we're actually, we're, we're actually, we're actually obsessed with both. We got a, um, we got a, cord, like a cordless um, vacuum cleaner, a shark one, because we've got a shark main hoover and it's really good so we just got like a handheld cordless like one of the big cordless ones we got one of those and then we got the shark cleaner as well i highly recommend shark products we've had our hoover for absolute years and like every time something goes wrong with it they replace that part like it doesn't matter how long it's been they will 100 percent replace that part uh, let's put you down here. Willow had a nasty sprain on her ankle and ended up having to go into A&E with that. And that was like, oh my God, that was a drama. Really like this one. See you what I've noticed as well. Like, I don't massively, when it comes to this kind of planning, notice a difference like I don't mind mixing um clear with let's see is that gonna look better there no it's gonna look better here isn't it yeah I think I'm gonna put that up there like that right let's see what we can do on this page because I'm not loving it not loving it at the minute. I think there's too much going on, and that's why I got a new chair as well, a new um, like office chair. Well, it's a gaming chair. It's actually called a gaming chair. We've got another one of those, but a small one, and it's so much more comfortable, and I can recline on it, which I absolutely love. I can like recline all the way back, so when I'm watching. Um, that's why it doesn't look right because I haven't done my, haven't done my April. Um, what shall I use? I really like this gazebo -y. Will that cover that? Yeah, it will. And then I need my, these are from the Graceful Muse subscription. So I've got Aprils, but I'm not going to put that there. I'm going to put it like up here, and then should I put that there? That's a little bit better, isn't it? It was throwing me off because I hadn't done that top corner, and I really like that there. I've got these really thin pieces of washi. I think I'm going to put one of these inside this box. Inside this box. I have ordered um, a, another planner. <laughs> Shock horror. Sterling Inc. Um, did a sale, didn't she just on her 2024 planners I'm not, I'm not gonna keep you in suspense and make you wait so I did get the um, the vertical uh, standard TN size and I will be doing some back planning in that I wanted to give like I wanted to give it a go so that when it comes to next year I know what like planners that I'm, I'm I want to use so I thought you know while Let's put that there while they were on sale I may as well buy one because then I can try it out can't I so I have got that I'm loving using the A5 as the memory planner I just haven't sat down and done any kind of memory planning at the minute I'm very aware of that I've been absolutely shit when it came when it comes to YouTube it's just because the kids have been off Chris has been off like he's took the kids out now but it's just been I've got a little corner here 
yeah it's just been like one thing after another like willow ended up in a and e with her ankle because uh, we thought she broke it but she hadn't she'd sprained it thank god um i had to have my second colonoscopy oh my god it was a million times worse than the first one i i i just got triggered like really really bad triggered like i i had two panic attacks they had to stop twice i had two pan panic attacks on the table um what annoyed me right is um when we found out about the original colonoscopy we rang them up and we said you know i suffer from um ptsd due to um i'm not going to say it here because it like it's triggering to some people but we explained my situation to them they were like yeah yeah okay okay no problem and so um that allowed us to have special circumstances to to keep chris in the room and for them to you know allocate appropriate time which was all fine um i'm very aware this hasn't got much deco going on um which was fine but what really annoyed me is the second time we went um exactly the same situation they knew everything that was going on um but obviously i was better on the first one because it didn't trigger me. i know what triggered me i'm not going to say it but i know why i was triggered by it um but I, it was something i wasn't expecting and it triggered me massively like i was on gas and air for the, i was in there for an hour and a half for a procedure that should have took like half an hour because they had to keep stopping i was on gas and air for the whole time which i wasn't before but anyway after they said to us oh maybe next time you can um you can ring ahead and, and let us know that you suffer with ptsd and i was like are you are you serious are you, are you being serious with me right now and she was like well yeah and i was like we did we did we informed every person we could inform about me having ptsd hence why my husband was in the room with me for special circumstances because she even said oh don't tell anyone that you ha your husband's been in with you and i'm like shut up you idiot like it's not this isn't a game like oh her husband's allowed in and her husband's not no my husband was there to to stop me i tell you what if he wasn't there i don't know what would have happened because he was the only one that could calm me down um in that situation then and yeah so it really pissed me off because they were like next time tell us and we can uh, allocate the appropriate time needed i said how about next time you read the notes before you bring me in because if you read the notes what happened wouldn't have happened and um yeah so but i got through it okay they removed the polyps and all that malarkey and i'm all good to go just thinking as well what color tombow i should use for here but i'm not 100 percent sure so i think i'm gonna leave it like this it's just so quick and easy to decorate these pages. I'm obsessed with it. What have I got left on here? I've got those two on there. I've got so much left. Hardly touch that sheet. I've got that one. This one. I haven't took any of the florals off that one. Didn't use any of the functionals either. So I've got them left to do my take a note. Take a note, this is my take a note to do my paper test designs. Um, yeah, so that was really quick, wasn't it? I need to do a memory plan with me so we can sit down and have a proper chat and catch up. But yeah, this is um, my take a note for the week of the 1st through to the 7th. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video, guys. Bye.